How y'all doing out there it's me. I'm a slight bit pissed off right now and you may be wondering why am I slightly pissed off it's because of this article I found on videogameschronicle.com. And the title of it says Sony confirms it will remove the PlayStation Plus collection in the library. Those who redeem the 19 PS4 games will still be will still be able to access them as long as they remain subscribers really Sony so what you're basically saying here is as far as PlayStation 4 goes that makes no sense at all. So anyway here we go the PlayStation Plus collection will soon cease to exist slowly interactive entertainment has announced really from May 9th the collection of 19 games will no longer be offered. Sony Interactive Entertainment said on Wednesday games can still be redeemed until this date and will be available. After two users were made PlayStation Plus subscribers you gotta be kidding you're joking right of course of course you're not. The PlayStation Plus collection is a library of PS4 games given exclusively to PS5 owners who are who are members of the paid subscription service of course of course I should have I should have known. I should have known that he that this is the reason why they're getting rid of it because again like like I said before their base is saying fuck you to PS4 owners what the fuck I think there's a little something you forgot to put in here would you possibly maybe you know possibly be able to put the list of which game you're talking about because unfortunately yeah. I don't see a list here anywhere oh maybe we do have a list here we go it originally included 20 games 10 first party and 10 third party games before Persona was removed in May of 2023 you have got to be joking you're kidding right. The collection includes God of War Fallout 4 Mortal Kombat Uncharted for Ratchet and Clank Days Gone Until Dawn Detroit. I guess they mean Detroit becomes Human Battlefield 1 Infamous Second Son Batman Arkham Knight The Last Guardian The Last of Us Remastered Resident Evil 7 Bloodborne and Monster Hunter of a Suite. Sony why would you get rid of something that is that you know does this little thing called make you money seriously why are you getting rid of something that is that actually you know does this little thing called make you money makes no sense to me. The features made available at PS5 launch in 2020 as a perk for owners of the next-gen console only of course at the time SIE Sony Interactive Entertainment CEO Jim Ryan said he hadn't decided if the PlayStation Plus collection would be expanded beyond its initial launch line of oh sweet Jiminy Christmas of course someone is behind this. Why am I not surprised to find out that someone is behind this brain-dead decision because this has got to be one of Sony's dumbest freaking ideas ever so it's like your base is saying fuck PS4 owners welcome PS5 owners that's for that's pretty much what you're saying dude. Ah uh, well we're going to wait and see how the world sees the PlayStation Plus collection he told GQ Genius Quarterly I think is what that is. You know which games you know which games are played how much they're played before we make any decisions about that. You got to be joking right so it's like you're basically saying it depends on which game it depends on how many games it depends on which games get played and how much you're fucking kidding right you're fucking kidding. Oh god Jim Ryan why are you doing this? You are showing how much of an idiot you are. Here we think it's potentially going to be a great user acquisition tool. Arguably if you never had a PS4 and you choose to buy a PS5 you basically get a PS4 right of course. So Jim Ryan you are a fucking asshole for doing this. Ryan's Ryan has said that a subscription model like Xbox Game Pass doesn't make any sense for Sony's first party operation considering it's focused on big budget games. A Christmas. And yes, Sony has confirmed placed it the PlayStation Plus Essential Games. I don't know why they call it that. On Wednesday, they are Ali Ali World. Mafia Definitive Edition Evil Dead The Game and Destiny 2 Beyond Light. What the fuck? I could have swore the Destiny 2 thing was a DLC for Destiny 2. Oh. So yeah Jim Ryan you're a fucking asshole for doing this shit. So basically what you're saying again is. PlayStation 4s get basically a big middle finger right up the ass end. PlayStation 5 owners basically get. Basically get a big bag get basically. Get a big bag of basically giga picnic lunch. 
PlayStation 4 does basically get nothing at all. So what are you gonna do with the PlayStation Plus? So again, what are you gonna do with the PS4 orders that still have PS4, but haven't got a PS5 yet, you idiot, did you? Ever did you ever think of that, huh? Think about it. Think about it, dumbass. I don't believe this, you guys. So is it like the last 19 games you've offered or the ones you're talking about here? Or are you talking about just these ones in general? God of War Fallout 4 Mortal Kombat. Uncharted for Ratchet and Clank Days Gone. Until Dawn Detroit Become Human. Battlefield 1 Infamous Second Son Batman. Arkham Knight The Last Guardian The Last. Of Us Remastered Resident Evil 7. Bloodborne and Monster Hunter World. Are those the ones you're talking about? Um, did I think there might be a little? Something you forgetting here. What if some people already own them? Already own some of those games, huh? What about then, huh, so what fuck them? So basically you're saying so basically. PS4 owners might as well just you know. Might as well just kiss the might as. Well, might as well just kiss the PS plus goodbye forever. Because Jim Ryan, you are a fucking asshole for doing we're doing shit like this. So why did you so again? Here's a question. Why did you even start this damn online? Service of all if all you were gonna do is just get rid of it at some point. What was the point in starting this online service if you're just gonna get rid of it? Does that make any sense at all? I didn't think so, guys. I did not think so. So once again, once again, in case for those of you who haven't who didn't hear what I already said, Sony has confirmed that the PlayStation Plus collection will be removed in May. And those who are doing the 19 PS4 games will still be able to access them as long as they remain PlayStation Plus subscribers. So what's the point in having PlayStation Plus then if there's going to be no collection for us to get? Think about it, huh? Think about it, think about idiot. Jesus. So yeah, if you guys did enjoy this end, and I hope you did you know go ahead and feel free to drop a like. You know leave your thoughts on this. Bullshit because frankly that's what it is. And while you're at it guys, you know share this video around for those who don't already know this. Information please. Because honest to God this has got to be one of Sony's most. This has got to be one of Sony's most brain-dead decisions I've ever seen in my life. Because really because what you're doing is you're proving once and for all. Sony, you don't have a clue what you're doing. So here's a here's a way you could compensate people, I mean PS4 owners. You could, oh, I don't know, you could. Maybe. Um, you know, you could maybe possibly you. No offer classic PS1 games. You know that sort of thing as a, as a way of compensation. So that we don't come off look like a total asshole. Which you are in this case. Oh my god. Oh my god, this, this. Slowly, this has got to be one of the dumbest ideas you've ever it's gonna be. One of the dumbest ideas you've ever pulled. Guys, just go ahead and do all that stuff. Yet that I keep saying to do like. Comment, subscribe, click that bell too. Possibly be notified of future videos. And guys, if you guys have already gotten your boosters and your vaccines and all. That stuff good for you and for those of you who haven't yet might be a good idea to get them okay. Oh my god, this is. I swear, Jim Ryan.
You have no idea what you're doing at this point. Because it's like PS4 orders are. Basically, we're gonna are basically being told in May. Get the fuck out. PS5 owners are being welcomed in very warmly. So basically, for more months of this, service is going to be available on the PS4, and then that's it. And then that, and then that's all that's. All we get, that's all we get, people, yeah. I don't believe this. I don't believe this, people, I'm sorry. Well, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm being really randy here, but you know you know. What? This is one of those times I feel I feel. I have to. All right, guys, you guys all have. Yourselves a good day. And you guys try and you guys try and understand and you know just just enjoy yourself just try to enjoy yourself as best as you can okay